Hello friends. Today we are going to read Colorful Birds. The author is Chaturika Jayasurya. The illustrator is Chaturika Jayasurya. The translator is Alisha Berger and the publisher is Room to Read. So let's read colorful birds. So what birds is the author talking about here? And can you see birds in this picture? Why are they all white? They are not colorful. So what is the story about, do you think? Let's see. Once upon a time, all birds were white. Make me beautiful, Grandfather Magic, said Woodpecker. Come, I will paint you a beautiful color, said Grandfather Magic. So in this picture, you can see that there are a whole lot of birds and they were all white in color. This was a long time ago. So what happened? When you see birds now, are they white? No, right? They have different colors. So how did this happen? Let's see. So in this uh, picture, you can see this bird. This bird is a woodpecker. And the woodpecker asks this person, this is grandfather magic. It looks like he has this wand. What is this? This is a magic wand and he knows how to do magic. And Woodpecker asks Grandfather Magic to paint him a color, to make him beautiful. And Grandfather Magic says he will paint the Woodpecker a color. Woodpecker was now red. A little bird looked at Woodpecker. She wanted to look beautiful too. So now Woodpecker has been painted a red color. Doesn't he look beautiful? And so then this other little bird who is still white in color, looks at Woodpecker and says, wow, Woodpecker looks beautiful. I also want to look beautiful. So what does this bird do? This is my favorite flower, said the little bird to Grandfather Magic. Will you paint me the same color as this flower. So what does the bird do? She takes her favorite flower to Grandfather Magic. You can see it's yellow in color and Grandfather Magic has been asked to paint the bird the same color. Grandfather Magic painted the little bird a beautiful yellow. So here you can see the bird is now yellow in color. It's beautiful. The yellow bird went to Woodpecker. Look how beautiful I am, Woodpecker, said the yellow bird. No, no. I am more beautiful than you, argued woodpecker. So what's going on here now? The red woodpecker and the yellow bird start arguing that I am more beautiful than you. Oriole tried to calm them down by holding them apart. During the fight, the yellow 
color of the little bird mixed with the red color of woodpecker. Oriole became orange. So what happened here? When the woodpecker and the little yellow bird are fighting, Oriole, that is this white bird here, it's a third type of bird, tries to calm them down by holding them apart. Don't fight, you know, he tells them don't fight by holding them apart. But when he does that, the yellow color from the little bird and the red color from the woodpecker, they mix together and change the color of the oriole. Red and yellow make orange, right? And so the oriole becomes orange. Orange Oriole, Orange Oriole. The parrots teased Oriole. Oriole chased after them angrily. So in this picture, can you tell what's going on? Who are these birds? They are the parrots. They are still white in color. And Oriole is here. He is orange. And what are the parrots doing? They are teasing Oriole that he is now orange. And Oriole gets angry and he starts chasing after them. Oh, Grandfather Magic, cried the parrots. Please save us. Come. Let me paint you all green, he offered. So what do the parrots do? They run away to Grandfather Magic. Save us, save us from the Oriole who's chasing us. And what does he say? Look, what is around you? The color green. And I can paint you the same color so you can hide. So he paints the parrots green in color. Can you see? Look, it's they're all a pretty green color now. The green parrots showed off their color to Kingfisher. Where did you get this beautiful color, dear parrots? Go to Grandfather Magic. They chirped. Kingfisher liked the color of the sky. So Grandfather Magic turned her blue. So the parrots that are now green go and show off their, pr their pretty green color to Kingfisher who is still white. And Kingfisher likes it. She says, wow, you look so beautiful in that color. Where did you get it from? And the parrots tell her to go to Grandfather Magic. And so when Kingfisher goes to Grandfather Magic, she tells him that she likes the color of the sky, which is blue. And Grandfather Magic paints her blue in color. Kingfisher went to meet Woodpecker. As they were talking, Pigeon crashed into them. Oh no! So here are Kingfisher and Woodpecker. They are just talking. And here comes Pigeon, who is still white. Pigeon is flying in very fast and crashes into them. Oh no, so what do you think happened? A little bit of red from woodpecker mixed with a little bit of blue from kingfisher. Pigeon looked at the smudge of purple on her. Purple looks good on me, 
she thought. So then what happened? The red from woodpecker mixed with the blue from kingfisher and what happened? It became purple and there was a little smudge, a little bit of purple on pigeon because pigeon crashed into both of them. And pigeon liked the color. She says, purple looks good on me. So what does grandfather magic do? While grandfather magic painted pigeon purple, all the birds joined them. What a wonderful rainbow of colors. So grandfather magic paints the pigeon purple and then all the birds show up. There is the woodpecker, the oriole, the little yellow bird, the parrot, the kingfisher and the pigeon. And look at all the beautiful colors. I hope you enjoyed this story. Thank you. The difficult words in this story are Woodpecker, Oriole, Parrot, Kingfisher, Pigeon. Try these questions. What is this story about? Try mixing yellow and red paint. What color do you get? What color do you think you would get when you mix blue and yellow paint? Try it out.